Hello, this is Kane with Bull Ridge Plumbing here at 709 Oak Valley Lane. Uh, <clears throat> doing a dirty movie in the basement. Uh, we did come here to do a clear um, on the main line. Uh, there was some type of blockage that they were unaware of, and we found it. It was about 53 foot in. Um, I'll get there when we get there. Uh, we are at the city tap here at 110 foot. We'll go ahead and start backing up. This is a SDR line, and it is in really good shape. Uh, everything about this whole entire sewer line is in great shape, except for the one root intrusion that we got back at that 50 foot I was talking about. Try and speed up through this part. Got a little bit of sludge on the walls there, but nothing concerning. We did use every bit we had. Um, we used our K9. We used uh, off of there. Use the K9, K9, K60. There we go. Um, uh, we used our three, we three-inch cutter, our four-inch cutter. We basically used our whole bag of tricks to try and chop this one up. It was. 95, I'd almost want to say 100% blockage, but we were, we were able to get the camera through the bottom of it. Um, now, as you can see, it looks a lot better. Um, this thing was probably about two, two feet long as well, so there was quite a bit of roots there. Um, this is the only spot that the line has an issue, and uh, we are recommending a root X treatment be done to finish up the rest of that because uh, my bits just won't get to it anymore. Um, besides that, the rest of this line is impeccable. I'd give it an A+. Plus. Also, another note throw out there for uh, uh, any viewers is that that root ball is actually right behind the Y on the outside clean out. Um, we try to attack it from that side but unfortunately it's on the back side of the Y and it's a directional Y so we cannot go backwards on that. Again, accessed in the basement. Uh, we went through this uh, three inch clean out right here, right next to the water heater. Thank you for watching.